Hi, this is Siobhan Pan, and I am going to show you how to modify templates. The set that we're going to be working with is a set of summer prayer templates that I just put on the website. Now, though there is a free one in PDF format that you can download, and anybody can do that, print it off, and send it to everybody in your church. For Effective Church Communication members, there is a set of actually 18 postcards, and I'll just go through this while I'm speaking, that you not only can print off there in your uh, zip file as PDFs, but you can also edit these. Now, let me show you some of the ways that you might want to edit them. For example, maybe you don't like the typeface here. All you have to do is go into the Microsoft Publisher template, click on it. Now, when a box comes around it like this, you can see that it's actually word art. You go over to your little box where it says edit text, and then you can click on any typeface that you want, something like Calibri. I want it just to be more clean and contemporary instead of kind of fun and funky. Just change it to that, click OK, and there you go. Now, one isn't better than the other. A lot of it's just your personal preference. Maybe you want to move around where you put the typeface. Maybe you uh, want it up here. Maybe you want to shrink it down in size a little bit. Whatever you want to do, being a member of Effective Church Communications and having access to the template, you can do it. You can also add a note from your church. For example, you might want to modify it to be something like this. We have so much going on this summer at First Wonderful Church, and we don't want you to miss out on the back of some events your family might enjoy. That's just a text block. Create it, put it on there, and then... On the back, instead of having I'm praying for you, you could change that to something like join us for, and there you could list whatever events, contact information that you might want to do. Maybe you don't want to make as extensive a changes, but you might just want to say something like, hope your summer is wonderful. You might want whoever receives it to know right away that it's from your church. And so all you would need to do is add the little text block here, your friends from our church, First Baptist, First Presbyterian, um, St. Mary's Church, whatever it is, hope your summer is wonderful and go on from there. Little changes like this can help to personalize the publication, but I've done all the work for you of finding the illustration and putting it all together. The basic work is done, but you can do whatever you want to do to personalize it. You could also do more where perhaps you put the majority of your message right on the front. I added a white box to it. Here we have a box that you could put in event information, the name of the event, time, location, child care costs, why people should attend, and your website information. Something like this works out really well because people don't have to turn the card over to find out about things. And you could directly just put this on the refrigerator and they'd have the information right there. One more change, very, very simple, of course, having access to the templates is that you can change the color of anything that you want. Um, let's highlight the text here, go over to Format Word Art, and maybe I want that also to be in a color and maybe to go along with the blue, I want purple. And you've got that purple. Maybe you don't want this to be blue. Maybe you want it to be another color. So you click Format Picture, Recolor, and let's make this red. And here we've changed it a little bit. Um, maybe that those are the colors that we like a little bit better. It really doesn't matter what you do to modify things. The point is you have all the flexibility and options you want to modify things any way you want to modify them when you're a member of Effective Church Communications because you have the editable templates included in the zip files that you can download for many, many, many publications across the web. This is Yvonne Pran with Effective Church Communications. And be sure you check out the website, EffectiveChurchCom.com, for many, many more ideas and resources to help you serve our Lord effectively in church communications.